Donald and Melania Trump are not your typical presidential pair which is in large part why they are so wonderful for America. They do things much different from their predecessors in their roles, especially Melania as First Lady, which we saw today with a major overhaul she just made in a new wing of the White House. This is sure to infuriate Michelle Obama and is the first time in history that something like this has been done, which shows how serious the Trumps are about making the people's house for the people. After years of the White House being shut down to citizen visitors for tours, which was a decision made by Michelle Obama who didn't want to deal with the peasants, it's not only open again under the new administration, but guests are seeing something nobody has been allowed to before. Even for those who have been through the White House before, they have new reason to go through again. Melania Trump decided that guests should be allowed to enter one of the landmark's more entertaining rooms in a certain wing of the White House, which has never been done before. Independent Journal Review reports, in its May 12 statement, the White House noted that, at the direction of First Lady Melania Trump, visitors to the East Wing are now being treated to a new piece of history along the tour route, the White House movie theater. President Trump chimed in on the First Lady's announcement on Friday, the White House belongs to the people of this country. I believe everyone who takes the time to visit and tour the White House should have as much access to its rich history and wonderful traditions as possible. It is my hope that our visitors truly enjoy the newest piece of the tour. The decadent Red Room boasts 51 seats and tiered rows, as seen in a picture Melania shared on social media as a taste of what visitors can come see for themselves. The room itself which President Franklin D. Roosevelt converted from a cloakroom in 1942 has a long history at the White House, IJR reports. The room has gone through a number of renovations since then including during the Reagan administration in the ADS, and then again under President George W. Bush. As the White House has been closed to the public, the theater has been reserved for use as a space where presidents can practice major speeches, like the State of the Union, and occasionally for its intended purpose of relaxing with the family to take a break from the stresses of the job. It's a little no part of the White House and one that Melania thinks would be fun for people to see as an interesting element of this monument. What's perhaps the most impressive part of this, is not just that the White House is back open to the public, but people are allowed to guide themselves for a better experience. Prior to now, visitors have been herded in and out in what felt rushed and almost like an assembly line, which really takes from the experience of going. For most people, this is a once-in-a-lifetime visit, and out First Lady has made it a priority to make it special in every possible way. The American people appreciate the consideration and changes. Not only undoing all of the crap that the Obama administration gave us, like ending all tours of our White House, but improving upon a favorite vacation tour. Thank you Mrs. Trump, one reader commented on IJR's article. Wow, that is great that tours are self-guided. I was rushed through on a tour and felt like I saw nothing much but the line I was in. Great idea. First Lady, Melania is so gracious to remember the White House also belongs to us another reader wrote. The Trumps realize that they are guests in the White House just like the rest of us and want everyone to see where the nation is run from, rather than the former couple who thought they were royalty. When Trump campaigned to become president, he spoke to the average American who are the heartbeat of this nation. Moves like this prove that he meant what he said and continues to make the common man number one. Please do not forget to subscribe and like and comment because we want to hear your voice and thank you for watching.